Got it. Yes. <laughs> yeah, these things, these things, uh, these things vaporize. Hang on a sec. Into so, okay. does a heart piece appear in the? No, but you up? do hear you do hear the sound of slow clapping. Not from the ghosts, <laughs> surprisingly. Clap them. But finally, something does descend from above. Hang on a minute. And I selected the wrong token. Not you. No, a black heart shadow blade descends from the sky. <laughs> it's like, well, this is gonna be easy. A black heart. <laughs> fell black heart. It's like, yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, it's like the 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 theoretically, a, uh, a a fell black heart uh, like minion theoretically could fight you indefinitely. <laughs> A fell black heart oh, falls from the ceiling and dies. If, if I if I just rolled really well on the saves and the recharges, it could theoretically fight you for all eternity. It just whittle us down seven HP at a time until we're yep. dead. Well, no, no, it does it does double damage if it started its turn in. Uh, well, not stars. If it was in the black uh, the not the black heart form. The uh, if it was in its misty form. Yep. Anyway, dis descending from the sky is oh well, not the sky descending from above in the dome. Is a it appears to be a tiefling with the uh, wings. That's no, Oma. I mean, a, a tiefling with wings. Mm -hmm. And she's slow clapping, and in uh, her and in one hand and in one hand, Cintiq, you notice she has that uh, that uh, skull that you were carrying. Does the tiefling look anything like that one that I uh, saw back at the black holes? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the one that the one that uh, came out after after the uh, that temple fell. Okay. Can I stealth check? Uh, this kind of you're kind of still in the initiative, so let's see here. Oh, okay. it's not really your turn anymore. Um, uh, fair I wasn't sure if this was, so that's why I'm asking. Yeah, it's it's semi combative. It just well, depending on depending on y'all's actions, what will happen. She descends down. She's like, good show, good show. So, I see you come into my arena. Oh, dear. So, tell me, how did you escape the prison? We walked out the door. Pretty much. She, start, she sternly looks at you guys. Such flippant manner of talking. No manners. Told the truth. She grumbles. So, why were you here in my domain in the first place? Coming up to my tower. Well, we're selling these fine leather jackets. <laughs> 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 she, she looks. She looks directly at. Cintiq. She looks directly at Cintiq and says, "says." If you value the lives of your friends, will you please tell him to shut up? That wasn't in character. <laughs> <laughs> I, I never can. Actually, it very well might have been. <laughs> it, hey, I'm not, I'm not my first match. I, uh, I feel like Sleep, we already lost the value first. on Hemix's life after he died the first time. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, oh yeah, you, you missed... I never told you this during the, during the extensive Halloween special. Hemix had died in a previous thing, like he he died. Dude, really stupid, terrible roles. <laughs> he, uh, yeah, it was it was like a death. It was like this final death throw of an enemy, and the enemy reduced him to negative bloody. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> it was it was insane. But anyway, anyway, in another like a session later, it was the Halloween special. They uh, they put a, they found this uh, pool that was fabled to resurrect people, and they put him in it, and. It corrupt. It brought him back to life, but it corrupted the well, and the temple crashed down on them. Because <laughs> okay. Hemic is actually evil. A little bit. Oh. A little bit. But anyway, okay. Well, it's all about how you see it. Yes. Uh, I mean, only if you think that killing people is evil. I mean, well, you were a serial killer. <laughs> all right. But anyway. Anyway, so back back to back. <laughs> that was a, that was a nice little uh, non sequitur. But back to the back to the action. 
It's like that was a, that was a very bizarre commercial break. All right. So anyway, anyway, she she does ask those. So why do you come to my tower? I didn't come here. I was brought here. And it's like yes, but you step you stepped on my mountain. Did I? Yeah, that's that. Well, you were uh, like similar to these people. You scaled. You scaled the like. You know, you you were investigating. You scaled the mountain to get to to you know investigate. You were assaulted by zombies, knocked unconscious, and she brought you here. Oh, she brought me here. Well, they. You know, you were brought here, but maybe by her. She ordered you brought here. You assume. Roland is just going to say, do you have any property papers or, like, deeds? Because otherwise it's just free land, you know? Earth is of all of us. I, she, she blinks twice at you very sternly, which is weird. You know, how, how do you blink sternly at someone? But she... <laughs> I, not, not sternly. She blinks twice at you, almost, like... Like really? Incredulously. Uh, incredul th thank you. <laughs> incredulously. <laughs> she blinks twice at you incredulously. She's like at five AM? How how in the yeah. How in the nine hells did did you imbeciles make it this far? Lots well, of murder. Basically. <laughs> it's like Well you see this here mountain? This is my mountain. All upon it is mine. The trees, the stones, the snow, everything that makes up this mountain is under my grasp. The mountain belongs to me and I to it. You have no place here. But now that you've arrived, I can't have you leaving. No, ma'am. The mountain wouldn't want that. Well, I was... want you to stay forever. And I'm going to see to it that its wishes are fulfilled. Nice. <laughs> she's, she's, she's like, ah, oh, sh such sharp wit on this dwarf. Well... And she flies, she flies down to the center of the room very well. I was hoping we could come to some sort of an agreement, but I can see this is beyond my power. We could still come to an agreement if you wish, but I wish to imply upon you that this mountain does not intrinsically belong to you. It belongs to nature. Hmm. She's, like, she's like, oh, such semantics. Do not commit. Do not carry dominion over that is that which is not yours. <laughs> well, she's like obviously we come from very different cultures. You can see, this is my domain. Whatever I see, I own within it. So <laughs> therefore, I own your ass. And she she uh, stamps she stamps her foot down on the ground, and the sand begins to rustle around here. It's like, like so many before you. Oh, shit. She's like, so, shall we parlay as it were? Or do you wish to continue to talk about what is and is not mine? Again, I never said I wanted combat. I was willing to talk. Just making clear my views on the situation. Very well. I suggest we party, and she's just going to <laughs> <laughs> pull an arrow on her. Okay, so the can I surprise extra shooter? I don't think I can. Yeah, yeah you can. You can. Uh, well, with something like that, I'd say go ahead, surprise Disco round. Ball moves from the ceiling. <laughs> it, it, you you can just yeah, only Roland gets the surprise round. <laughs> Roland that just spits out a two picks. He's somehow been all. chewing on this entire time, and mm -hmm. same initiative. Yeah, yeah, you you guys are just keeping your initiative. It's kind of like it's semi, you know. I don't have common advantage, do I? Or no, you, she's surprised. She's surprised. You have come. Okay, she's not yet acted. Yep. I'll, yeah, that too. But yeah, it's just you have a surprise action because that. It's like what the hell. <laughs> I didn't she has a very. I not resist that. All right, I will. I will say this. Like, dang it. Okay, I will say this though. Just like even though. Alvin Accuracy. Okay. Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, what was that? Thirty-eight. 
Okay, so 30 uh, damage. Actually, technically, you don't even 16. add that dice because it's not a dice damage roll. Yes. Yeah, so Let's see, sneak deck, so 16 plus 8 plus 6. Yeah. Yeah, 16 from sneak plus so 30 damage. Total. So 30 damage, okay. All right, so, yeah. And wow, that, yeah, that, that rattled her senses. 12 damage. Okay. I just have to shot, so, yeah. <laughs> All right. So yeah, yeah, you just you just straight up hit her, like yeah, like you winged like the side of her neck. That that got her pretty good. So uh, yeah, now I'm gonna add her to the initiative list. <laughs> we only came here to find Roland, but now Roland started the fight. So. Uh... <laughs> well, the thing the thing is about Roland. They brought her for different reasons. They tried to recruit her, and she fought back, and then they were able to waylay her and took her prisoner and put her in a prison and put her in a freaking Iron Maiden. He's like, why are you here? Oh, why are you here for Roland? I don't know why, <laughs> this, I don't know why the dwarf... Well, the dwarf's oh, here for nature. God. Death is gonna get so weak. Okay. Did I roll initiative for her yet? No. Oh, that was so nice. I was totally emulating uh, Levy from Black Lagoon. <laughs> oh, okay. I've never watched that show, so I... It's good. At least I like it a lot. <laughs> okay. Well, anyway, uh, Hemic. Hemic, you are up first. first. Actually, no, wait. I've got... No, we're both <laughs> at... We're both at uh, plus eight. I'm just going to say you probably have a higher dex. Ever yeah, so slightly. Five. So whoever has the higher modifier goes through. Yeah. So was it technically the end of the encounter, or was it like? No, not really. This oh. is like an ex this is an extension of the encounter. Okay, so, so I still have my thing. Okay. Yeah, you like whatever whatever stuff you have, you still have. Like the encounter never really ended. It was just like it was just well, like for a couple of rounds, you guys talked. This is a Zelda boss fight. I mean, the way the room is set up, all the Zelda boss fights have two phases. <laughs> The funny thing okay. is, that, the funny thing is, even though I've seen Zelda being played, I've never played it. All the 3D games, the bosses always have two phases. Yeah, okay. But anyway, so yeah, he she, how is, where is she? Is she flying? Is no, she, she she landed. She's on the ground. Yeah. Okay. Do I want to charge her? I'm, I'm that very may be a bad idea. Uh, oh, just imagine she did like the warning shot. So like the first shot was straight miss and then just straight to the face. Yeah. Uh, I don't really want to just hold my turn where I am though. Uh, you can you can actually make a, like if you like after this session uh, you can you can steal some of our macros. What we do is there there are conditions within HTML the macro. HTML works in macros. Yeah. yeah. So if you yeah, want to just I, make text I know works. I use font HTML size, HTML macros, but I just need to remember what the actual. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you can you could just uh, copy paste like some of our some of ours too. Like I know I know Chris has some pretty handy ones. So does Dill, but Dill has like like a gazillion conditions because of all his uh, stuff. Well, that is my one macro to rule them all. Yeah. It's a little. It's a little, like I've 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 tried to mess around with Dill's macros. It was daunting. I, t I never touched it again. I can throw on another character that is does not have does not do everything through one single macro. All right. Well, anyway, it is your turn. He makes. I'm just gonna told. Okay, so go ahead and uh, mark yourself as yeah. Okay, so infernal armor guardians are up. He moves up a square. I'm and, gonna regret doing this, but guardians counts. And he is going to. Guardians bounce. Okay. One, Going for it. Two, three, one. four. Oh, I don't want to get too far with him. Mm. Okay. Sorry, no, sorry. So Did there, this, um, 
If the combat never ended, then Tarkas is still in a rune state, probably. Yeah, he is. Okay. He's in a rune state. I still have the Storm of Break going. Because you, if you're on the other side of him, you'd probably get the. Uh, okay. So go damage. ahead and yeah. So go ahead and. Oh uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, see here. Okay. Oh, there it is. Guardian's pants. Yeah. Thirty-one versus AC. All right. Yeah. Full damage yeah. minus five to attack rolls. Okay. You bust him. Oh. <laughs> Oh, no, sorry. Hang on. Whoops. <laughs> sorry, I'm not used to healing my, my... I'm not used to healing my creatures. <laughs> yes, there was some more. I was going to be like, oh, God, there's four more enemies. Oh. All right. Yeah. Okay. So that was one. Another one charges at you uh, to Thrades. I don't approve. Oh, jeez. I'm getting hurt. Uh, yeah, five damage. Oh, he's so hurt. My resist too is so helpful. And uh, this one moves to here. It just moves to here, and this one also moves just to here. And that, that's all they do. Uh, they get bonuses for being adjacent to each other or something. And they're also trying to block. Okay. Yeah, Roland, you're up. Um, yeah, we'll uh, let go first. Still so oh, you still, you want to go? Did you want to go? No, here? I'm going to let the ranged character go first before I possibly prone her. Okay. This makes sense. All right. This does indeed make sense. I'm going to move over here. Stealth. Okay. Pretty sure you're hidden. She still's not acted, so. Yeah, that is true. There is oh, some, God, yeah. There, you can get combat advantage six ways to Sunday. You have the advantage. Uh, of you got the touch. You got yeah. the let's power. Do this again. Looks very well last time, so let's do yeah. it again. Six. Uh, oh, that actually hits. Dang! Hell yeah! She's not like a defender. Not she doesn't have. She's not wearing armor. <laughs> wow! It's like cloth. She's like she's got max <laughs> level AC. I don't want like what sixty damage on this one target. Yeah. She healed, but yeah. <laughs> Alright. So, uh, now what? Now I'll go. Okay. After. If Roland's Hang done. On. Okay. Let me move you down. Boop. Oh, careful where you move. <laughs> Just be yeah, careful. Yeah, I know. I don't <laughs> there, there, and there. <laughs> well, this square is fine. Yeah, that square is perfectly safe. Um... Actually, I can probably just shift to here. Okay. And make sure I'm in the right Totes one. Can. And charge. Okay. Actually, I have to charge this square. Okay. Let me check something real quick. Just checking. All right. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Oh. Oh, snap. Okay. Uh, number one, this happens. Hang on. That probably misses. Does it hit? Yes, fortitude. Yeah, that hits. Okay. My fort is my. Ouch. All right. You're pushed three squares. It does say it's a reaction, though, so. Okay. Well, I see what is... a... Oh, no, it's her hitting me. Yeah. Okay. And. Reaction to the, that would be the first attack. Okay, yeah. slow down going 10. Alright, then. Uh, just first, I'm gonna throw on my other one of these. Oh, okay, that's fine. So that's 45 and prone. Okay, so 8. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I gotta put that at 37. Yeah. That's the second time she's been crit. Okay, and then you are adjacent to the spikes, so... And slowed. Slowed save ends, I'm a life save ends. Six. 
Yeah. Luckily, it's not like it's not ongoing damage from the spikes. It's just you take the damage once and then yeah. you're stuck on them. Yeah, you get impaled by a spike. And that's pretty much everything that I can do then. Still, your damage are pretty hard. Yep. Okay. Lady Madrashka's turn. She uh, stands up. And I got to see something real quick because it's been a while. Like I, like I was planning on this last week, but then I forgot what happened. Oh, never mind. Yeah, we didn't have one last week. So let's see here. Looking at these, I just got to make sure everything's right. Okay. All right. So this happens. Uh, number one. You make. Uh, let's see here. She's going to use this ability. And hey, this is this unhinging ray is actually a basic attack. So, Whoa. Yeah, yeah, oh, this is this unhinging ray is horrible. So, Hemic, guess what? You're not going to be immobilized by the spikes anymore. Well, maybe not. I don't know. This guy's this will hit. This is attacking your will. It might. Yeah, it was some secondary. Mm -hmm. Okay, five psychic damage. You're slid, and oh, make a basic geez. attack against uh, Tethrades. You're no longer immobilized. immobilized. Save ends. Yeah, well, as long as you're adjacent to the spikes. I made up the okay. uh, like like the spikes were made up by me, so of course there's going to be plot holes in how they work. <laughs> yeah, you're not you're not stuck on them anymore. So obviously you're no longer immobilized. Save ends. It's all in my head, no, just I not in the notes. Oh, you missed him. You missed. Actually, I think it's 23 damage, but yeah. yeah. Doesn't matter. It didn't click yeah, the, you missed, the bloody button. missed it. And here's the, second, it, here's the second unhinging ray. This is versus Tethrades. And it misses. Yay. And the third one is versus Roland. It's range 20, this thing. Dang it. 21 Cash. hit your will, right? Oh, goodness. Um... Easily. Okay. Uh, I'm going to slide you like right here. I don't know. She's going to slide you right here. Can she slide you over the bar? Yeah. The bar is technically difficult terrain. But difficult well, terrain is both, difficult terrain. Both of those squares would be difficult terrain, wouldn't they? It's a force movement. It's a force movement, not a shift. Oh, yeah. But anyway, uh, so yeah, nine psychic damage. You slide two squares, and you're gonna make a ba you're gonna make a basic attack against Cintiq. Basic, barely. A, a a no, a ranged basic against Cintiq. Oof. Uh, I have not used shield this encounter. <laughs> so let's do that. <laughs> a good idea. Man, that wasn't even with sneak attack. All right. Anyway, let's see here. I gotta check something else. Okay. Yeah, she moved. Okay, she used her move action to stand up. She did that. I gotta check something else. Minor or action point? Um, I'm thinking about an action point. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, she's gonna use her. She's going to use this. It's a close blast five. It targets enemies with an action point. Yeah, this. Yeah, I let me let me get the template out. Sorry, I talk us. Yeah. Oh. yeah oh, never mind. Sorry, sorry. I, I have it on a race mode. Is this a fear or charm? It is a charm. Because I oh, think sorry. I can. Uh, yes, um, I would like her to target herself with that as well. You can do that. Okay. Yes. Any other creature than five squares. Okay. <laughs> Sounds legit. <laughs> One, two, three. I am rubber. You are glue. Okay. So, here we go. <laughs> oh. That's supposed well, to be in She intentionally That's whiffed that, so she wouldn't get hurt with it. Yeah. Okay. That, obviously. Let me check the yeah she's and she's got a good modifier on the two's plus nine but yeah she just whiffed she seriously whiffed that Look, four three four 
Yeah, oh, that's that bad. was intentional, so she wouldn't hurt herself. Right, that was half damage. Yeah, At will blast five quasi dominate. Jeez. All right. Well, anyway, I'm gonna slide you. I'm gonna slide you right here. What, where'd you go? Oh, never mind. I accidentally slid you. I, sorry, I was supposed to slide there. And I'm sliding Tarkus here. Okay. And she's uh, she's gonna slide herself right here. I'll take like, <laughs> two damage. That's cool. And so yeah, so yeah, she takes uh yeah nine fire damage. So let's see here. Oh, oh wow. thank you for she putting takes... her in the perfect position. Okay. Five. All right, I'm five. feeling something, aren't I? Yeah, five fire damage. Let's see here. Oh, she missed. Oh, wait, never mind. So it would only do half damage. Oh yeah, never mind. Yeah, they're doing four damage. All right, I'm not gonna bother with the damage right now. So should be four damage. There's, yeah. Not five. Four, one, five. Oh yeah. Yeah. So four. So she she didn't take any damage. I, I just remember now. I should give myself my free temporary points for getting attacked. Yeah, uh, I forgot something, but it's a snooze you lose situation, so I'm not gonna bother with it this round. Yay! Because that's just how I roll. A. All right. So, uh, Cintiq, it's your go. Don't bother attacking the knights, please. I'd wait for it to three to get out of the way, so she can, Cintiq can just nuke them. <laughs> Oh, uh, I could. I can have an area or attack I can do as well. So. Don't bother. Let's target the bloody dude. But this uh, area you're looking at a wizard. wizard. I can't do. Area controls what she does. True, but as soon as they start their turns, they're dead. That's yeah. true too. Yeah. What's the uh, What's the zone here? Storm of debris. It, it's his. It's his. Oh, that's one. right. Uh, is it a Is it an area of effect or it's a, a aura? It's not an aura, otherwise. It's Each enemy that starts its turn within two square of you. Oh, okay. Okay. Go ahead. Go I ahead. Put. Uh, although there is a. Uh, a go. T let me. Let me just put on your aura too, just so I can kind of see it. Yeah. There it is. What's with the What's with the AOE here, though? I'm wondering. Oh wait, never mind. That's my AOE. Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not five five o'clock where you are. It's uh midnight thirteen. Uh, I mean, I think, like two days from now, I went next day. I'm not sure if this is really going to be worth it, but. I think one of our guardians hit her. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, hypnosis on her. Or you can throw, like. Okay. Let's see if this will work. Daily fireball on her. Nope. No, yeah. it misses anyways. That Man, doesn't... you miss with hypnosis a lot, which is weird. It only misses yeah, with hypnosis when... Versus Will, which is like the weakest something. defense of most creatures. Probably except for her, though, because mage. Oh, it's, oh. it's not worth it, then. Uh, do I have anything else to do? Probably not, really. Let's oh, call yeah. Uh, have that. Yeah, no. Although I could. Hmm. I could move up. Not that it really matters. Don't whistle into the mic, please. Oh, I'm sorry, man. Is it like. Is it like. Every time I do, it's like. With every, like. No matter if it's headphones or speakers, it's just like this piercing. Yeah, sound. It, oh, I'm sorry, man. It's okay. Not turn as terrible as it could have been, but it'll be her turn. It doesn't work. All right. Let's see here. Tarkus is up. Yeah. All right. I want to use my flames of fury because I want to heal people. <laughs> but can you? Well, I'll use it. If it hits them, does yeah. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I'll just do it. Okay. I want to use the fire. Oh, right. Fire. Well, it's fire radiant. Oh, well, then. Yeah. Because it's, yeah, it's like that. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, uh, yeah, so it's going to. 
Yeah, it's. Wait, what? What does this do? Uh, Flames Furious is my attack. All right. Every hour gets healed. Who's in the blast? But enemies so get uh, one. En enemies get um, enemies attack. Yeah, they get attacked normally. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Uh, I mean, the one minion's gonna enemy. go down. Why don't you just shift it o shift it over left one and get Hemic with it? Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Let's shift. Yeah. Let's shift it like that then. All right. Okay, so one, two, three enemies, and then Hemic and Teferatis get seven hit points. It's not temporary, it's just seven actual hit points. Yay! Okay, so... Three enemies. Oh, okay, it's, it just got uh... progressively worse. Oh, It's the first one. Misses and misses. Yeah, so. Yeah, okay. The main thing was for the healing, but okay. Um... That's gonna help against that ongoing 10 damage. Let's see. Uh, I still have another. Still have another rune of mending. Uh... We've also got the daily. Part of me is kind of happy I went ahead and made those uh, states for the ongoing 10, because before we only had ongoing 5. <laughs> um. I'm pretty happy Which, with the way those came out too. They look nice. They're they're they're, all, they're borderline pixel art as well. You actually look at them, but from a distance they look pretty nifty. A certain distance. After a while, it kind of blots out, and you can't tell what it is. And like each one has is color chaotic. You know, looks like that. Anyway, anything else, Tarkus? Uh oh, did uh, did Ash leave? Yeah, no, still here. Uh, okay. Honestly. You're kind of cutting out there, dude. Muting and unmuting. Oh. I have to be a okay, I, am, I am. I'm back. I was just talking. I was like, what did what'd you, what'd you say, Aryan? I'm just going to be a bit quick. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Uh, just, do he make or Tephrates want to shift at all? Uh, that would be pretty cool. I yeah, would shift two squares. need to, but I could. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to use natural terrain understanding. Close burst free. Each ally, uh, you get plus two bonus power bonus to AC until the end of my next turn, and you can you can shift up to two squares as a free action. Okay, that was my minor action. I'm gonna go to there. I'll shift me. Damn it! I'll shift down to there as my move. Okay, that's me. That's my turn. That's me in the corner. Yeah, it's me in the corner. Alright, so to threes, it's your turn. Uh, mark everybody. Alright. Roots of Stone. The minion. The minion. The other minion. The maid scroll. Okay, Yay. so. Alright, so that's versus AC. Let's see here. 20 versus AC. That hits the first guy. So that's another 15 healed. And second guy misses. And it hits the gal for uh, 15 damage. So she loses the damage. Yeah. And then, because I'm a little bit injured right now, second wind. Ooh. So I get. 19 hit points, and then I get all sorts of nonsense, and then they take a minus 4 penalty to attack anybody else. So uh, that's a minus 6 by that point, that's nice. Yeah, minus 6 more penalties than minus 2. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, I don't know. Oh, and I get 5 hit points. Let's 
Cyclops stone. So it's like every you get everything. Yeah. <laughs> for for a minor like, action, just just awesome stuff happens. Yeah. yeah. That's pretty good. Plus five or plus four to all senses. There we go. Good to go. Okay. Next up. Get to the shit down, map tool. We'll be right back. Okay. Next up, Infernal Armor Guardian. He's going to try to attack Tarkus. No, he's not, because he's going to take 500 damage and die. Oh, he is. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> he's not. He's going to try it. No, he isn't. Okay. It's because they're made out of metal. They just attract the electricity. <laughs> All right. So that it's happens. Like lightning rods. All right. So it is Roland's turn. Well, we'll, uh, we'll oh, okay. You're just, back. Okay, you just gotta wait for. Uh, I have to load in for a yeah. second. Oh yeah, and so. six more. That's right. I'm dumb. Uh, let's see. Let's see what she wants. She wants to. Want to uh, Shifting. Not yeah. Ha nothing happens. Oh. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, I have to include him in the birth. So. Yeah, there we go. I want him dead. <laughs> Draw the uh, area that she can't leave, because that's an end of encounter thing, isn't it? No. Oh no, end of your next turn. Never mind. It basically, if she leaves her square, she can't. She falls from. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, she can or move to any. Does it move like this? It's, I mean, yeah, she can move down adjacent to you and still be in the area. Whatever. All right. Did you manage to get in? Um, I'm still loading for some reason. It's taking a while. Ah, that's weird. Oh, there I am. I was going to say, just go on without me, and then. <laughs> load it. Okay, I'm back. Hmm. Well, Let me check I something how this works. Oh, this again. She is in the club brain. Yeah, that's good. Um, the chair is kind of as difficult to rain, right? No. Mm -hmm. uh, the chairs do. Oh, the chairs, yeah. But it doesn't matter. You're ignoring difficult terrain. Yeah, I know, but oh, when I'm yeah. in difficult Oh, yeah, terrain. this stuff, yeah, that all, that all counts. Like the bleachers. Mm -hmm. Uh... And like this bar, how does this? Yeah, it's considered this difficult terrain as well. Yeah. Zoom. And since you ended two, two or more squares away, you know, stealth check. Not that it matters, because, uh, yeah, it does matter. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you're hidden. Okay, yeah, 16 damage. That is low damage. Wow. It is. Jeez. Uh, I don't know. It's, oh, 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 sneak attack, yeah. <laughs> the weapon damage is like, yeah, it's above average weapon damage. <laughs> well, on a D12, that's... Average. Low average. Oh, well, as D12 is like 6.5 average. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, it's, it's seven's above average, ever so slightly. <laughs> and a six is below average. Yeah, but you rolled a four. <laughs> All right. I rolled anyway, a four on that. Any, so. Anything else, Roland? Oh uh, no, that's good. Okay. Next up is Hemek. Okay. Um. Take you ten necrotic. Yeah. Necrotic. Yeah, the neck rope tick. You moved down there. Crokick. Then you're gonna go down there. I want to shift it back there to where it can charge. I'm gonna move here. Okay. Then I'm going to. Have I used. I didn't use Boots of the Fencing Master this fight. 
That was the last fight, I believe. Yeah, that was like up in the up in the uh, when you were still fighting those uh, insubstantial minor. Chances. So I'm gonna use that to be able to shift one more. Then I can charge. Oh, nice. Missed. Oh. And I already used heroic effort. Yep. Action points. I know, I know I've got action points. And this is an. Can I spend an action point? Did I use one last time? Uh, you gotta keep track of that, man. I, I don't. I, last, I mean, I've got action points to spend. I just don't know if I used one I, last fight. Yeah. Um. I'll flip. Did. I'll flip. Let me. Hang on, let me just flip a coin. I probably did. Let me just flip a coin. One is yes. Two is no. Wait for action points. You you did not use. spend an action point. Okay. okay. <laughs> I'll try another one of these. It won't matter. Well, I, yeah. No. Okay. Because I oh, well. yeah I think you did spend one at the start. Well, yeah. he he really doesn't have one now. Really, <laughs> definitely super doesn't. No. Yeah. All right. Um, so it is Lady Mizrashka's turn. Uh, what is she going to do? She is. She's take. She's being penalized here pretty bad. Uh, she's going to use her hellish wrath again. No. Let's see here. Is she going to use her hellish wrath? Feel my arctic blast. Um. Man, this is a bad round to use stuff because she's just taking. A, she's gonna have to just. What, oh, is, she, what is she gonna do? I'll attack the two other guys at minus six. Oh, yeah, I'll... I know it's it's just one of those it's just one of those things, man. Yeah, uh, yeah. Put put me in a conundrum with that minus six. Um, she's just gonna she's gonna shift thusly, and okay, she's gonna use hellish wrath, but she's gonna she's making basic attacks. So, Horn Staff against Tethrades. These are making separate basic attacks, so they'll. Well, it's it's all it's one it's one action. One power. Know. Yeah. And she misses Tethrades. Lol. Okay, and then here's the, with the minus six against Hemek. Oh. <laughs> really botched. <laughs> And she's not going to bother with the third basic attack because it's arranged, and that would just be that would be abysmal. So, man, she that, that's a sucky turn for her. <laughs> that was yeah. It's just it's just a bad for now. Yeah, it's just a bad turn for her. You saved against the ongoing necrotic though, so that was good. I did. I rolled a twenty. Mm -hmm. Cintiq, it is your turn. Chris, where did you go? Oh, hey. Old, okay. Old oh, where do you go now? Where do we go now? All right, so Tarkus. Yeah. Uh, okay. Trying to get away into the night. Something, 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 something. Say, I think we're alone now. <laughs> I think I'm a clone now. Oh, no. There's always two of me just a hanging around. <laughs> okay, for the sake of it, was just title spirit shot. <laughs> for the sake of putting her back in flanking. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Tiflings need to know their place. Yeah. Which is being flanked. Sandwiched by, sandwiched by a dwarf and a human. Obviously. Boom. Oh, a one in eight thousand fans. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. And no more. So anyway, anything else? Anything else, Darkness? Uh, does anyone need healing? Darkness does. <laughs> Tarkus heal Tarkus. Tarkus need healing. Tarkus very much need the healing. 
No, shut up, Tarkus. <laughs> shut <laughs> up, Tarkus. You don't get healing. But Tarkus love you. Okay, fine. Tarkus will heal himself. <laughs> Tarkus so only speaks in the third person. He doesn't speak in the third person. He's speaking to his alternate personality. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who also happens to be named Tarkus. <laughs> <laughs> Only with an I. T-A-R-K-I-S. Tarkus and Tarkus. Or cuss. Yeah. Okay. Cuss and kiss. Okay, so voice. 19. Yeah. One, one, is, <sighs> one, one has an English accent. Yeah, but it just kind of sounds like this. That's damage. Like I give it yokel damage. simpleton. <laughs> Voice. I don't know, man. I mean, it's not a good idea. Okay. Is and that then Tarkis totally needs the healing. Okay, then Tarkis, Hemic, and mm -hmm. Tarkus. Tarkus, Hemic, and Tarkus. Tarkus, Hemic, and Tarkus. Tarkus, Hemic, and Hemic, and Tarkus. Tarkus, 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 Hemic, and one, two. It's kind of just a bizarre falsetto. <laughs> I think that's it. Pee -wee, kind of Pee Wee Herman in there as well. Oh, Rick Star, he's that uh, Rocket Thunder. All right. Tith Rates. Tith Rates. Tith Rates. I never actually used this one. Tith Rates. Bum, 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 bum. Back up. Use my burst too that I still haven't used. Whoop. Oh, yeah. Storm and Bree. You didn't need to move. Wait, favor to AC. Yeah, it, inclu it includes allies. It, uh, it targets everything. Yeah. No, but he could have put it, like, here. Uh, okay. Hmm? Oh. It's a burst too. He could have just gone on these squares. He can put it to the side. Hey, without close having moved. Burst? What? Oh no, it's, it's close, close burst. Yeah, it's a no, close burst. Blast. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it, it's okay. Okay, let's see. But here. full damage, slide two, slow state. Oh yeah, it does slide. Holy crap. Okay, so slide twenty-three. Three. So here, please. Okay, so yeah, 20, 23 versus AC. All right, so twelve, twelve damage. Yeah, I'm gonna be back in a minute. Nice. All right, All right uh, does uh, does Cintiq want to go? Oh, why not? Okay. Don't go now. Let me just toggle off hold. I am the god of hellfire, and I bring you fire. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. So, yeah, y'all were being snarky, and then Tethrady said some pretty badass stuff, but was still very antagonistic. <laughs> I'm sorry. Fireball. I was trying to sound yes. tough without being tough. Yeah. Fail because Roland was like two arrow at things. I was like, oh. I mean, it won't do much because there's only <laughs> one target, but why not? Combat time! Maybe you can burn, 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 burn up the spikes. Burn, burn, burn. Burn up the spikes. Yes, I'm going to attack the spikes too. Put some of the attacker. Spectator ghosts. The spectator ghosts are just like they—they they aren't actually there, although they are. That's pretty meta. <laughs> I met a man who. They're there yet not there. You were the spectator ghosts the whole time. Oh, you geez. are the, the Twitch chat was the spectator ghosts. <laughs> yes. Wait, oh, that was... They're all shouting, they're all shouting, nerds, nerds! Oh, no, there's only two of them, like, off in the corner, no one's listening to, going, nerds, nerds! Oh, 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 oh. Nerds! Oh, are we... My bad, that was Fountain of Flame I rolled. Uh, are we shadow... one instead of... Are we shadow banned? <laughs> that was yeah. so funny. It was like, we just weren't responding to them, because we didn't even notice them, those trolls shouting nerds, and they just thought they were shadow banned. Have you, uh, spend your action <laughs> points? They're like, hey, dude, are we shadow banned or something? I haven't yet, but I already used Fountain of Flame. That should be Fireball. Fireball. I mean, 
you hit and did some good damage, you could just use Fireball. Yeah. Well, the thing is, I already had, I, I had already used Fountain of Flame. I meant to click Fireball. I misclicked. Oh, you had already used that power earlier, it's right? It's the same roll, though, right? Uh, attack, yes. Damage is not. It's... Okay, uh, let me let me heal her up and just you just re-roll the damage. Okay. Right. I'll just actually roll that. I remember the zone now. I'll have to do 28 damage. That would be neat. Uh, we'll probably do more. It's fireball. Well, Watch it's the same less. total damage, so. Why'd you do less? <laughs> it's actually possible. I rolled above average, I think, on that. Yeah, I would have rolled above oh, yeah, average definitely. on fire pulse damage. Oh, just two less. That's actually, nice. wait. <laughs> One of those is a one. Oh, right, you have... Okay, uh, no, it's still a one, then. Okay, so 26. So it, is two, it was two less damage. And you don't get anything else for being bloody. That's just a hit. Oh, is she's she not bloody anyway. Nope. Yeah, no, she's not. She's been continuously <laughs> healed. Oh, yeah. She's been somewhat healed. All right. So, anyway, let's see. Now it's yeah. 60 HP, but still... What? That's what? unsurprising. I'm surprised. I'll just walk over and find dust. Where was that power? When was the last All time right. that was used? So anyway, Fertile Guardian 5 shifts thusly and he's going to try to stab Hemic. Oh, no. Don't they both die? Because they started uh. in two within Tethrate. You know. They did, didn't they? Okay, <laughs> never mind. Emic, you are not hit. <laughs> I mean, she'll get 38. So it's just, they'll just keep coming up and she'll just keep healing. Oh, yeah, that could be a problem. We may just need to attack you to make uh, your state go away. <laughs> it's like, it's like, it's like we need one of, the, we need one of those, one of those elite black hearts to come in and put you to All sleep. All you have to do is hit me with a polymorph power and I lose my form. Nobody has those, sadly. It's like Sadiq. fire based. She does not have Beast it's Switch. Good. Yeah, she doesn't. Does, oh, Beast Switch. Does it, Beast Switch does not uh, polymorph. Does it count as polymorph? If even though, even though the even though the the flavor That's is like point. polymorph, it doesn't actually That's polymorph. Uh, it doesn't have does the keyword. Does it count as a polymorph effect if we turn him into a corpse? <laughs> <laughs> Well, no, technically you're not getting unconscious, so yes, probably more perfect then. Okay. Just yeah, get that, that one, is... like, assassin girl over here to not get unconscious, save ends at will. Okay. Yeah, she, uh, she's dead. Remember? <laughs> Lol, remember? Okay. Like Alright, uh, Roland, it's your turn. Okay. You know, those minions auto-dying was... <laughs> I figured that's that was a good thing, thing before. Does, do they technically start their turns on the board, or...? Yeah, because they spawn first, and then they start their turns. Yeah. Mm. Immediately, they take their initiative goes immediately after they spawn. Mm. Let's see, I move over here so I can get stealth. Mm-hmm. All right, nice. <laughs> you just keep moving back and forth in the peanut gallery. <laughs> it's like, look, like these I'm ghosts home. are these ghosts are watching the fight, and she's just popping up behind them and looking over their shoulder. Oh I'm just acting like it is the ghost shooting at her. I didn't see that. I don't think anyone did. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. It's Twenty of the damage she just healed. That's some damage. These D12s are not friendly to you tonight. No, no, they're not. Two plus eleven. Oh yeah, I got it. At least my 3D8 is doing something now. Yeah. I need to you. Alright, so, Hemic, Yo, it's Hemic, up it's to you. <laughs> it's up to you. 
it's up to you, Emic. Yeah, well, I guess I'm just charging. All right. Oh, um, miss it. What am I at HP? Miss I'm it. Not this much HP. I'm just gonna invigorating stride first. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I like zero. that you. I like that you included the shift zero. That's great. Well, eventually that will actually be a shift one. That is true. <gasps> gonna okay. take like. I think it's actually gonna be like. You'll have I, it. Won't, it won't be until you're like level fourteen. It's gonna be after. Yeah, it's gonna be after Paracon. It's like because yeah, your 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 uh, whiz will be like one at Paracon. So yeah, for at level fourteen, you'll just pop your whiz one higher. Oh, nice twenty six. That's all like it. Does she do her thing? Uh, she's March. She's not gonna. Yeah. That may be a mistake. Did you say steak? Oh, no, I missed. <laughs> no, wait, no. What is <laughs> mistake? <laughs> My steak. <laughs> okay. Mistake. But really, I'm... Well, she's... Okay. She's prone. But it is her turn. 16 damage. She's prone and slow. Hmm. She's prone and slow. Yeah. Okay. So she's no longer prone. She does take the five damage from Tethrades. I'm useful. Yep. And what is she going to do? She's going to use her invoca. <sighs> okay. This is gonna. Well, I don't know. Tarkus, you're a little useless to this. It's a close burst too. She's going to use her invocation of wrath. This is a close burst too. Uh, I don't have the macro set up to where I can negate points from it. So what I'm going to do is just going to... I'm just going to imagine a minus two on you, Hemic. It's a close burst. So two that if it's a burst, it'll... So it's just... It yeah, includes I mean, him in, in the attack. Oh, it includes... Oh, it does include him in the attack. Yeah, okay, I mean, you're not making individual right. attacks with yeah, the other right. powers. Okay, Hemic. Uh, Hemic, you are dominated. Save yep. it. Uh huh. Okay, and then she is going to. She is, she is going to uh, go ahead and use her other action point for hellish wrath again. This is her second action point. She's going to burn her last action point. So number one against Tethrades here. She's going to use her horn staff. Ow! And she misses. <laughs> And, okay, she's going to use unhinging... This is going to provoke an opportunity attack from you, Tethrades. So go ahead and make your opportunity attack. Uh, who is it targeting? You. Oh. But it's a range. Yeah, it's a ranged attack. Okay. And you missed. Okay, nice. So, so this is versus you, Tethrades. <laughs> that it, your will? Um, yeah, it is. Okay. Okay, sh she slides you like this. Make a melee basic attack against Hemic. He is granted combat advantage. The Ow. 16 damage. Yep. And then sh her second her second attack is against Hemic himself. With unhinging ray. Right here. Nice. Eight, uh, 19 hit your will, Hemic. Yes. Okay, you take eight psychic damage. Well, uh, wait, never mind. Se Seventeen versus Will. Seventeen. What? Be because she, because. Oh yeah, then it's a miss. Okay. My will is an eighteen. Okay, so yeah, and then the final one is against Tarkus. Wait, wait, hold on. Before that, before that, I have an immediate reaction. Okay. Also, Ooh, she did three crap. attacks because you tried to hit him with a stick. All right. Yes. Yeah, he, I hit to Thrades. Yeah. That is true. And then slide her right next to me. Okay. Give me some hugs. All right. So yeah, that's uh, yeah, that's all she can do. Well, let's see here. Yeah, that's all she can do. Tarkas. <laughs> Y'all are kind of making some headway. Whatever you do. Do not be in charging distance of Hemic. <laughs> Stay right where you are. <laughs> Just right in the sweet spot. 
It's like a reverse sweet spot. Because <laughs> he's dazed. It's, it's the Guffin spot. Yeah, that is correct. Only, only, only you're, you're, you're not, you're, only you're the chargee, not the charger. All right, so word of exchange. That hits. Yay. Nice to all defenses, nice. Ooh. Oh, neat. Next time I hit it, it's a plus three to eight. Jeez. Yeah, the word of exchange is an awesome power. It is quite nice. Okay, next up is, indeed, to Thrades. Move. Mark of Thunder. Ow. Oh, wait, 19. Oh. Uh, so, yeah, let's see here. 20, uh, 19. Uh, her, her AC, let's see here. Her, her defenses are minus 2. 17 still would not hit. Right. But she's still marked, and if she makes an attack of the Boomy she takes 5. Okay. Takes 5 damage on her turn, and then another 5 damage if she doesn't, if she attacks someone other than you. Yep. Uh, actually, uh, I'm going to spend my Meyer to do Crickers Ice. She cannot shift into or out of Crickers Ice. Nice. She's not there for Emma. That's nice. Nice. Very nice. Okay, but anyway, so much oh, fun. Oh, all right. So much fun. fun so much fun. <laughs> so much fun. Okay. So anyway, uh, Cintiq, it is your turn. Uh, I like being back here. <laughs> Where the difficult terrain makes me safe. Well, I'd be far yeah, away. Anymore. Um, actually, how far away am I right now? It's here. You're here? Ten. One, one, two, three, four, five. You could, like, get behind a desk. I hear morning birds. <laughs> oh, yeah. That would the bird. be my bird. Yep. The bird yeah, you, birds are early could, risers. If you're they uh, know. six squares movement, you could get to either here or here and get some cover. I guess that's true, yeah. How they run. I guess the door's open too. Of course, so let's see. Uh, do I wanna bother just doing this or just magic missile her? Magic missile is gonna do nothing. I'd use all your like non basic things and then Yeah. Well it's basically just that wolf at this point. Except for burning oh, hands and I'm not gonna get down there. <laughs> no, I'm not moving that close. Magic missile does like nine damage. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. about that's average for scorching bursts, isn't it? Oh no, you no, get plus scorching two from a little bit more, but it's like, is it because pyro? Is it worth the? Is it worth missing though? Well, I can just say, just take nine four. I think on it average, do much, but. I think on average, if you just magic missile, you'll on average do more damage. Yeah, it's just magic missile now. Scorching burst nine is like damage. six plus five plus two takes the nine damage. plus two, and another so two like, from staff of ruin, but. Okay. Yeah, like. So it's be, oh, I'm sorry, guys. I think you're just getting an extra d6. I mean, oh no, I think that was going to happen but... eventually. Yeah. Yeah, but there's also pretty even a third of a chance of missing is. So um. Yeah. Does magic missile count as a hit? Because the next no. ally to hit that no. target gets plus three to AC. No. You okay. did not make an uh, attack roll. So yeah, Cintiq okay. doesn't get the plus three, which I'm actually kind of glad about, because Cintiq doesn't need that. Alright, <laughs> so next up, let me see something real quick. Uh-oh. Oh. What an improv on the rise or something. Ah, ah, ah. Good. Hopefully not in my zone. Six is probably bad, but... Yep, never mind. So yeah, it kind of dies. Crawls out of the sand and immediately and just immediately dies and heals her. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, so gee, anyway, that, that was why I apologized. Well, that happened. 
Eh, I don't. The recharge on bloodied only happens the first time they're bloodied. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Even though, even though it's gonna pop up again when she's bloodied, because I was lazy on the macro. It's just a uh, little hard to to yeah. code it, code it to where it doesn't where it doesn't show up again. Doesn't matter. Roland's gonna bloody her again. Yep. Roland. Anyway. Rolling, 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 shifting stuff. No. That what are you here? I have to do mm. it normally. Yep, that is correct. Eight damage. Eight damage. <laughs> wow. Yeah. One. I rolled a one. All right. Anything else? <laughs> um, not yet. Okay. Hey, Mick. You look unsure of yourself. Yeah, yeah, you look unsure of yourself. You can't. You can't charge anything. She kind of. She kind of. Uh, she kind of snorts at you and goes, "Worthless cur!" And she sends you over towards the spikes. You can. Can't you make a saving throw? Okay, so. Like there. Uh, but, yeah. yeah. First, he, if you. Okay, you fall prone. You're now prone in days. Okay. Hmm. Go ahead. Yeah, so you're like right there. Nope. So yeah, well, it is a charm. Well, it doesn't matter if <laughs> <Two. laughs> you roll a two. <laughs> it's like a four. Well, eh. no. Okay. So that happened. Uh, all right, so it's Lady Madrashka's turn. She does not recharge that ability. Mm. And what does she do? Airport. Uh, no. All right. She's going to... Okay. Uh, she's going to provoke an opportunity attack from you, Threadies, again. 25 damage and the target is not prone. Oh, damn. Well, that didn't go the way I thought. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, all right. Well, I guess. Well, she used her move action and technically got got wrecked by it. Yes, she was denied the movement because she's now prone. The movement. All right. Cool. Well, okay. Could, You've made, but cool. uh, I guess she's just going to use her hellish wrath then. So unhinging Ray versus you to Thrades. This is a nice two because she's prone. Okay, 10 psychic oh, damage. Oh. You slide two squares and make a basic attack against Tarkus. Oh, and you miss. Yeah, well, I don't feel like it. And then versus Tarkus, this is a minus four. Play it again. That's something. All right, this, yeah, this is a minus four versus Tarkus. She's prone and and marked. And she botches. Whoa. A, is the other one against Hemic? Yes. Oh yeah. She takes That's a, a minus six because I'm prone. Yeah, it's a minus it's a minus six. But I'm six, also granting combat yeah. advantage. She takes the five seven damage for making a, an attack that does not include me as a target. Well, it's, te it's technically one attack, the hellish wrath is. Right. She takes five hundred damage for making an attack. Oh, right. You're making uh, Oh, yeah, okay. that's how that's how we uh, that's uh, like uh, you remember the previous session where we would discuss yeah, like the fine. dragon's double attack thing. So anyway, unhinging rat, unhinging ray. So combat advantage. Yes, minus starting. Yeah, she she will. Uh, I'll need to remember that. Okay, so versus Hemic. This is with those. This is with the crap included. So twenty two versus will. Okay, it's like six second damage. Okay. And you just slid right here. <laughs> and pro prone. Yeah, you slid to right. Oh, crap. 
You're slid to right here and make a basic attack against the Thrades. Oh, well, yeah. Well, probably, so. Yeah, it's a minus two. That is. Yeah. All right. That's not including any of the minuses, so. <laughs> She's on the ground just firing at people. <laughs> it's like. Man, that was weird. <laughs> It also takes five thunder damage for starting your turn. Yeah, yeah, I gotta, I gotta okay. put it on there. <laughs> yeah, she is just okay. Tarkus, it's your go. He's making the rumblies that only hands will satisfy. What? Have you watched all of that? Yes. Yes. It, it got it weird. Like a dozen more. Of it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. right. It's so... seriously dark. Yeah, it is. Not just comedically dark, but actually. You dark. must finish your work, Carl. Yeah, I, I saw. <laughs> okay, so two people. Very nihilistic. Right? Uh, I'm probably going to use Shield of Sacrifice. Uh, okay, so Tarkus will spend the Healing Surge. Uh, and two allies within five squares regain hit points as if they had spent a Healing Surge. They also get um, a plus five power... Yeah, everyone who was affected by the power gets plus five power bonus to AC until the end of my next turn. That's the most broken thing Rune Priests have. Also, it, it's, it's Healing Surge plus four because of my uh, Rune of Endless Fire. Why the hell are you getting rid of Tarkus? <laughs> Because my other healer is a lot better. Because <laughs> we want to have a healer. <laughs> See that? Thoughts uh, fired. Well, we all agree. Takas isn't a healer. What are you talking about? Yeah, it was kind of our joke. Because we did have a cleric of Paylor in the group as well. Who could out-heal uh, him. But that guy, he, he just... He was, like... he His schedule just was, like, not, not having any of it. Because he had, yeah. like... It's one of those things where if you have, if you're like working on like, I, I believe he was working food service. I can't remember, but you know, it's one. Of the, he was working at a restaurant. I believe he was working yeah. at a restaurant, but you know, you get weird out. So it's like, oh hey, like, oh hey, do you want to come in on Saturday now? Y'all have combat advantage for that. Yeah, I added that. Twenty. Okay. Does she still taking the minus two? Uh, the, still service at some point? Uh, yeah, she still has. Next turn, then, yes. Yeah, she still has the previous negative two. Okay, so that was a nineteen versus or a twenty versus AC. Then yes. I already added the combat advantage. Oh, you already added the combat advantage, so uh, it still hits. Okay. Wait, uh, does it? Eighteen uh, versus AC minus two. Eighteen versus AC minus two. But what? Wait, what? Oh, well, never mind. No, it still it doesn't hit. If if he included all the stuff in there, if he included the uh, combat advantage in there, then no. Okay, it does yeah, not. I, it's AC just barely. It just barely misses. Yeah, I imagine her AC minus two is nineteen. <coughs> yeah. Yeah, she just kind of okay. pulls off to the side real quick. Aha! I want to Aha. take a step back. Well, I still have an action point, so I'm going to use that and attack her again. Okay. Uh, let's. Yeah, that wait. was just a really roll low roll. Uh, well, I still have my, work, I still Carl. have my, I still have my other daily. <laughs> well, Might as well go out with a bang. No time like the present. She's prone. Okay. She's okay, prone, so. and this is the last time you're gonna play this character. Okay, so this is gonna be. Whoops, that's stop, stop. Okay. It's gonna be. Uh, uh oh. Uh, yeah. Let's see here. It's close blast free. And it's a persistent zone after the first turn. Let's. I rolled the stupid macro. Okay. One target. That totally One hits. Three. Okay. Blast well, creates zone that lasts until the end of my next turn. Leaving the zone costs two extra squares of movement. Any enemy attacks an ally who's within the zone grants combat advantage. Save ends. Oh. Save ends combat advantage. Oh, that's nasty. 
Sustain minor zone persists. Yeah. Well, she's going to have to attack you guys from inside the zone because she's going to have to stand up. Yeah. This guy would be pretty nasty. That was good. I think you did. I think you made a good decision. It is Tark or uh, Tethrady's turn. Yeah, so Tark is one step backwards. Tethrady. Mark. Mark so that she can. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, yeah, my group. I'll probably go there. there. No. Step back. Okay. Step off! Wait a oh. oh! She's double prone, I guess. <laughs> she's super prone. Yeah. She, she, she you drove her into the floor. <laughs> My own. Guys. Kiss it. Kiss it. <laughs> You're never leaving this mountain. You'll be. We will bury you. You wanted to be. You wanted this mountain so bad? Fine. Take it. Take it all. Okay. A man will touch. Um, that'll do it, yeah. Alright, Cindy. <laughs> um. I will attack her with that. I don't see any reason why not to give her 9 force damage. Alright. Can you. Would it stand up as a move action and drop prone as a free action? Drop prone's a. I thought maybe. Is it supposed to drop prone a minor? No, your phone is a free, I think. Even so, I think you could, on each of your turns, you could magic missile her um, and then just drop prone and hide behind the bar. Yeah, drop drop prone is minor For, action. like, superior oh. cover, and then just stand up, magic missile, drop prone again. <laughs> <laughs> I could. You're literally just popping up, throwing a magic missile, and hiding right completely behind the bar. That'll give you superior cover. Because we established they're okay. pretty tall. Alright. That is... Yeah, well, why not? I'll do that. Okay. Just in case you decide to start trying to... So anyway, it's Roland's turn. <laughs> hit you with... The infernal things. armor that come out of the sand didn't recharge, so... So it is Roland's turn. Why did you kill this man, Carl? Boom. Alright. I did not kill him. That is my least favorite thing to do. Ooh, nice. 20 damage. Damn. Damn, son. Still as on my sneak attack, but at least good on my D12. Oh, well, good on one or the other. Mm -hmm. I get both of my crits. All right. Anyway, it's uh, he makes turn. I can crawl. Yep, and that is what you shall do. And that's it. Roll a save. Yeah, you save. You have been saved. You have been saved. Surprised you didn't make me crawl into the spikes. Nope. I have other plans. Like, bring you from your domination. She, sta she stands up, and yeah, since she was bloodied, her wrathful curse had recharged. So this is gonna be Tarkus, <laughs> Hemic, and Tithrades. Blast five. 20 versus Tarkus's <laughs> reflex, <laughs> and then. And man, thirteen, thirteen again. Jeez, Tarkus, okay. does that hit your reflex? Yes, it does. Reflex is my worst one. Twelve uh, fire damage, and you're gonna slide right here. Hi, buddy. And you're going to attack Hemic with a basic attack. Okay, so I want to do that with combat advantage. Wait, uh, actually, let's see here. You're going to okay. You no, you can use an at will attack. You're going to use uh, words of exchange on Hemic. But okay. you get to choose which rune state you're in. <laughs> yes. You, you totes do. 
Okay. Uh, Are you in protection right now? Uh, yeah, I'm in protection right now. Okay. So I should have taken a little bit less damage than that. Okay. Uh, wave exchange. Let me just quickly read what that does again. Uh, <laughs> Which the effect you're going to cause it to do? Uh, well, I would assume she. I guess. I guess I would pick that. The effect. Uh, I don't. I, would you? Because that's free or not. Yeah, I choose make... my rune state. It's because uh, it affects my aura. Ah, okay. Because every time it's... I use a different rune state, it'll change my aura. Okay. Uh, I want to stay in rune protection, <laughs> <laughs> but I don't want to give him a negative two to all defenses. Well, rune protection will also give me, make me take less damage from your attack. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, destruction. She is now Let's granting combat advantage. Save ends though. Yeah, save ends. Wait, combat. is it if she hits? If it's she hits, or if if she uh, what? Uh, I think yeah. If you attack an ally, uh, okay. If you attack any of my allies, you get save ends combat. Advantage. It'll it'll be fine if you give me the minus two. It'll be fine. Uh, yeah, the allies have to be within the zone though. So yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, so. Well, uh, Tethrades was Tethrades was in the zone. Yeah, I was in. No, but she never hit me. Oh, wait, she she never, never, it's just if I still take half it's damage. Oh, yeah, yeah, CA. Oh, damn it! Eighteen fire and radiant. <laughs> the one damn good attack I have. It's okay. It's protection, so it's sixteen. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I, I looked at that. I was like, oh wait, it's a, it's an actual attack at, at will attack. Wow. The one good attack I have. Ever had for like anything? It's a chemic. I am so sorry. Well, that's really all she can do. Game straight. I said, did I ever do a recharge roll for that other ability? Let's see here. Uh, at least one, I think. But I don't know. let's see here. I did one last turn. She didn't do it this. Okay, she didn't do it this. Not this turn. turn. Yeah, she hasn't done it this turn. So I just gotta. She didn't make it anyway. Okay. Tarkus, it is your turn now. Yay. Right. It's your turn now. Yeah. She's probably going to die this round. I, I'm, I'm banking on it. Judging oh, by the way things again. are going. Judging by the way things are going. Hemix got ways of... I, I get to actually attack again, so yeah. Yeah. I did. I was kind of glad I locked you down for a little bit. It bought her a sweet few seconds of life. <laughs> Don't ask me. It's like, man, man, I should have brought back more coffer corpses. <laughs> Those guys are something. <laughs> it's like, like you know what? I need a way to make it where these guys just lose turns. Hmm. Mm. Coffer corpse. And will stunned. Stunned. And then when you, and then when you're not stunned, you're dazed. And then when you are dazed, you still have to run away from the guy. Dazed and have to use your action on a move. Yep. That will provoke opportunity attacks. Yep. That's pretty. Use one round, or you lose two. Yeah, I will never throw more than one of those at you guys again, unless you really piss me off. <laughs> unless we're like Paragon level, and you can. Mm. I leveled them up. I made them level appropriate. You're level 11, they're level 15. It all works. <laughs> Alright, so anything else, Tarkus? No. Oh. Okay, well, it's Tithrady's turn. Shift the Mundo. Way to Earth the Mundo. Alright, Tithrabies. <laughs> 11 damage and slow them. Still. Load him, so. That's now the wizard's turn. Yeah, we there's actually a condition thing where if you do score a crit, then the crit will pop up. Nice. Yeah. It's just like you designate a die roll. It's like Yeah, I've done done that all. If attack roll equals when I actually made 20. really fancy macros, like like when I I remember I had a battle mine that I, that I could actually keep track of his uh, power points too. So, oh, that was nice. Yeah. yeah. All right. So anyway, to Thrades. 
Oh no, it's Cintiq. Sorry, Cintiq. Oh uh, man, they're both unpronounceable. I'm not tired. I'm just hungry. <laughs> I'm exhausted. I'm gonna go through. It's a, a ma- it's plan. a freaking I'm it's a it's a freaking marathon, nervous. dude. <laughs> yeah. uh, usually, usually they aren't this long. It's just I wanted to get through this so you know that way Ash doesn't have to play Tarkus again. This would have been done if these guys were not immediately popping up and healing her. <laughs> also, also we waited an hour because Ash was Ash was uh, not here. But they've healed her for. Okay, but anyway, it is Cintiq's turn. So. 60, 90, 105 damage so far. Cintiq. Yeah, so 9 force damage. Cintiq, you freaking camper. Good cheat! Much. Stand up, freaking magic cheat. missile, drop down. What, 1v1 yep. me? 1v1 me! We're out like, of all of our uh, other powers. SMGs only! No sniper rifles! Except burning hands. I'm no, I don't. down there. The box so. only. <laughs> Okay, so Cintiq is from behind cover. Okay, so just another. Yeah, okay, so you're just popping up, throwing, throwing a nine at him, going back down. Yep. All right. Okay. The sand remains still rolling. Rolex. Good. I, I like that I'm actually getting Roland's name right. For the longest, I kept wanting to say Dolan. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Gooby, please. Gooby, please. <laughs> Yeah. And Roland. Where the fuck is Gooby? Dodge roll to the side. What <laughs> up? You have clam bait advantage anyway. Just uh, dodge roll to the side. Clam bait advantage. Clam bait. <laughs> yeah, I know it's habit. Alright. You have confidence advantage. Boop! Wow, you got her good. <laughs> and he makes he makes like now is my time. She's granting combat advantage from a thing. Yeah, yeah. Yes. She okay. just save ends combat advantage because she attacked a Boop. guy that was in the zone. Minor action, stand up. Stand up and shout. Move action. Okay. Shift back one. Charge. Yeah. She's yeah, dead. that would be. She good. had 16 HP. She's dead. Well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. On the second stroke, you would you do indeed uh, chop her like, like at the midsection, and she just goes completely in half. The sand is just bloody as hell. But you do, but the uh, you do notice the uh, portcullis has managed to lower as she as the life ebbs from her eyes. Okay, and we get a heart piece, right? <laughs> nope. But you do get a, a horned skull that she was carrying. Make sure to pick up the purple gem on the floor. As well. Oh yeah, yeah. There is a purple gem on that skeleton on the floor. We'll need, we'll need that to leave. Probably. And let's I'll just look it over for other loot. Yeah, Tarkus does the. Yeah, I, I'm gonna say this. You guys find some stuff on her, She's and got a I'll horn figure staff. out. I'll, I'll make an. I'll make it. Yeah, I'll make an actual loot table for you guys. I'm leaning yeah, to the side. I'm leaning to the so side, so my jowls are kind of funny. Does she have um the the helmet um helm of seven deaths? Yes, she does. Her, she does. As a matter of fact, it's in her pack, but. Okay. Anyway, yeah, that was one of the things she took away from you guys. But uh, anyway, uh, the the skull of yours is back in your possession. You are you are glad to see this thing again. You have a very weird connection to it, and you were very possessive of getting it back. You were very uh, distraught about getting it back. Possessed? By it. Obsessed, maybe. Yes, she will take it back. Jewel stroke it and comfort it. Mm-hmm. And call it George and love it forever and ever. <laughs> I will hug him and squeeze him. <laughs> it's like crushing the skull. <laughs> it's squ- oh. S- stop it. Yeah. You, you're hurting me. <laughs> Sadly, the skull doesn't have a neck to break. <laughs> Roland is again <laughs> yelling obscenities and Alphys at the corpse. Yes. <laughs> Where okay. did the ghosts doing? Uh, the ghosts actually dissipate. Hang on. Hang on! 
Are they happy dissipating, or are they just... They, they, they're like, they're, <laughs> they're fi- no, they're filing out, like, one by one. Like they, they, and, they, and they, just, and they, they, they yeah, they just slowly, they just slowly shuffle out towards, oh, hang on, uh, towards this direction and go up this way. And as as they as they're going this way, they just slowly disappear. So yes, the skull the skull is uh, the the skull does whisper in your mind though. Cintiq is like, it's very good to see you again, Cintiq. <laughs> what? What's so funny? Everything is funny. Here. Wow. I'm starting to think these two are going to start a romance. <laughs> yes, I'm totally shipping them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's our. Antique X Skull. Antique X Skull. OTP. Skull Teak. <laughs> that's yes. their celebrity power couple name, Skull Teak. I'm totally calling it. The heart is going to come back and is going to confess to Antique before the Skull can. Yeah. Yes, okay. Anyway. Anyway, uh, the skull, the skull, uh, the skull does, uh, does begin to, uh, voice it, uh, does begin to actually voice itself. But it's kind of shocking if you aren't, if you haven't, like, if you haven't heard the skull's voice, it's just basically everybody. But it, it just, it echoes throughout the hall. It's like, thank you for freeing me from the clutches of this horrible she-devil. If there's any way I can repay you. My oh. name is Morgan Skullman. <laughs> no, no, it's not oh, Morgan. Fre- oh brain. no! If it, was, if, it it was, skull. if it was Morgan Freeman, you'd know it. <laughs> like, if we still had Brainy, we could shove it into the skull. They could be friends. Yeah, that would be awesome. But no, you had to give it to the zombie. I wish I could tell you Lady Madraska was victorious and that she wasn't chopped in half by a hemic. I wish I could. <laughs> Hang on, I thought you said you were grateful. <laughs> no, no, no. That uh, I was like, I was like, that's a that's more Morgan Freeman. He's, yeah, he's, he's just kind of, he's just kind, he's just kind of as a low, lulling voice. <laughs> But it, anyway, so uh, yeah, the rest of you guys can actually hear this uh, skull talking. That's nice. Let's get going. Wait. Before we move on, I must tell you. The horned father. <laughs> the horned one. He, he He's clearly directing it at Tarkas. Not not Hemic. <laughs> or <laughs> Cintiq. <laughs> or the body. Or the corpse. <laughs> or the corpse. <laughs> Or hell, I don't know. Maybe Tithrades has a horned helm, and I just drew him wrong. <laughs> uh, no, there's nah. even like this, this yes, typhling, but then there's also he's the, more demon, spiky. the other demon. Yeah, no, no. I'm just, I'm just saying he actually has a, a horned helm, but I drew it. Through. See, we see Roland off on the side. She's holding her fingers to her ha- head, like <laughs> yeah, like horns. <laughs> yes, it's like okay. It's like, it's like this. This concerns the Minotaur. There. You know, there we go. Yeah. Yes, uh, Tarkus, do you respond to the skull talking? Uh, yeah, yeah. Tarkus is just gonna say, uh, like, what? Someone from your past, someone who has scarred you deeply, was here days ago. Mother. The <laughs> 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 water. So traitor, right? God, I can never be serious. I can never get a serious moment. This is why I try to kill this party all the time. Are you, Chad? I'm sorry. But that was too good. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Honestly, I would have done the same. But at the same time, I would also know I'm going to probably get my ass kicked next session. <laughs> Someone who was scarred. Just understand, from... You will be punished. <laughs> yes. Just, just, under, just understand. There is a code here, and you have violated it. 
<laughs> anyway, he's like, he's like, he's like, a person who has harmed you deeply was here. This one, Madrashka, she has trafficked with her before. Only now she is something much more monstrous. Anything about them, or is it? Hmm. There's not much. Only Madrashka had cast her out most recently. Huh. Well, she's, uh. It's hard to tell if she's, still, if she's still nearby. I'm not entirely sure, but from what I gather, she was out of control. Something, un something, something beyond the control, even. Of even the lady here. Land doesn't sound too good. Um, yes, for what I understand, she is in a very unstable state, physically and mentally. Lure we'll in, lure her in using Tarkus's bait. <laughs> nope. nope, don't move that. Sorry. <clears throat> but anyway, the uh, the skull the skull continues on. From what I understand, she is heading to the imperial capital. For what fiddle purpose, I do not yet know. Mm. <clears throat> but you have a unique blood connection with her. You might be able to stop her if there's time. Uh, yeah. I can. With the power of your axe. <laughs> I mean, friendship. The power of love. No. Not that kind of power. Power of voodoo? I may be... <laughs> voodoo? voodoo? You do. God. God, there is not a serious moment. <laughs> ever! Hey, you... you hey, that's you the most serious moment. Yes, but you, you gotta stop tempting me. <laughs> it's like, I, I have a horrible time concentrating. <laughs> 6.30. You expect me to have any kind of self-control? Okay. Well, anyway. Anyway, I, you guys are going to get your asses kicked next session. <laughs> but for now. But for now. Uh, sorry. Is the fight going to be strong enough that Tarkus doesn't survive? No. He's going oh, right now. Is going to go off? Yes. Yeah. I may, I may be able to give you the power. Possibly transport, transport you there. Maybe, maybe you'll be able to stop her. Maybe. I was gonna hope and he was gonna immortal Zod him. Give him <laughs> giant wings. Or oh, just uh, do a He Man. <laughs> he, he was gonna give me the power like He Man. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Fabulous secrets were revealed to me the day I held aloft my mighty helper and shouted, By the power of Asmodeus! <laughs> I have the power! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you <live> Scott. Yeah. <laughs> it's a yeah. Okay, well, I don't like the sound of going towards the Imperial Capital too much, but <sighs> Yeah, I suppose. Yeah. Mm. Well, I'll take whatever help you can offer. I don't exactly I don't exactly know where she is at this moment, but I should be able to I should be able to get you within a few leagues of her. Okay then. Okay. Well, I should be able to find her after that. Yes. So anyway, what he does is uh the skull begins to float midair and its eyes glow and a portal appears in the ground. It's a very fiery portal, mind you. It's like, okay, then. step in. And Tarkus does. And you fall through the portal. Congratulations, you're in hell. 
Nope. <laughs> yeah, Grung Grungar disappears from like Shadow Demon, and Tarkus gets absorbed by fire. <laughs> we just don't like the Scourge. <laughs> it's suckers! <laughs> My favorite line of Scorpion. That was from Mortal Kombat Annihilation. <laughs> but anyway. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, so yeah, you got a horrible Morgan Freeman impression, you got a uh you got a Prince Adam impression. Man, I'm just on a roll tonight. So, yeah, so as you as you step into the portal and out the other side, you find uh, you find yourself in a field and off in the distance you do see the Imperial City. It's it. It is it is night, but uh, the moonlight shines down, and you do see the Imperial City off in the distance. You're kind of in a wooded area, and you trek forward. And that's the end of Tarkus. He died. Fell down a bit of trap. <laughs> It'll show back up. Trust me. Just not it. Just uh, as an NPC, I'm sure. Yep. I'm sure they'll get to the Imperial City, and they're like, "Nope, we're going to the ice camps." <laughs> I was gonna say at our current rate, by the time we reach him, we'll be like Paragon. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. I've got things planned. White Wizard also shows up, but he is possessed by a demon. Well, <laughs> like Dimension Door for or something. God. All right. Well, anyway, yeah, we're gonna we're. Look. Uh, uh, gonna gonna end it here. I think it was a good session. It was a long session. It was a freaking long session. But do you guys like the map? Oh, by the way, okay. Here's what happens. Here's what happens after this. Hang on. Let me just go ahead and uh, lump you guys all together. And yeah. I was, I was like, wait. There's only four of you. And then I remember to delete as the darkest token. All right. Anyways, it's like, it's like, yeah, la -da 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 -da, you guys go here. And sure enough, there's a little thing right here, and you hit the little thing for the port call. It's because you have the gem now, and you go upstairs. La -da 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 -da. And there's this little panel on the floor, and it's actually a teleporter pad that sends you back up to the uh, surface. Uh, 